Did you know it only takes about 10 minutes to potentially save your life? That's how long it takes to complete a breast self-exam. Since your breast area can look and feel different as hormones fluctuate throughout your cycle, it's best to perform the self-exam about three to seven days after the start of each menstruation. For those of you that may not have a period, examine yourself around the same time each month. You'll need to examine your breasts in three different sets of positions. In front of a mirror, laying on your back, laying on each side. If you have breast implants, ask your surgeon to help you identify the edges of your implants so you can better distinguish the implants from your natural breast tissue. After you've identified where your implants are, press firmly along their edges so you can feel your rib cage. Then move your fingers around the edges to feel for lumps and other abnormal changes in your natural breast tissue. Visually check your breasts, first with your arms relaxed at your sides, and then with both raised above or behind your head. Confirm that your breasts are their usual size, shape, and color, without visible symptoms such as unexplained breast shrinkage, especially one-sided, new asymmetry between the breasts, nipple changes such as if they're slightly inverted, scaly, red or swollen skin on the breasts, areola or nipple, change in skin texture or enlarged pores on the breasts, like the skin on an orange. Use the pads of your first three fingers to move your hand in small circular motions around the entire breast area, all the way to the armpits, looking out for nipple sensitivity, lumps, dimpling, unexplained swelling, especially one-sided, or other abnormal skin changes. Look out for any fluid leaking from your nipples, which could be watery, milky, yellow, or bloody. While leaking milk if you're not breastfeeding isn't necessarily a sign of breast cancer, you should still get checked by a doctor if this happens to you. Lay on your back and use the pads of your first three fingers to move your hand in small circular motions around the entire breast area, starting from the nipple all the way to the armpits, checking for the symptoms we listed earlier. Be sure to feel all the tissue from the front to the back of your breasts, all the way down to your rib cage. For the skin and tissue just beneath your breasts, use light pressure. For tissue in the middle of your breasts, use medium pressure. For the deep tissue in the back, use firm pressure. Move the pads of your first three fingers in small circles, checking the entire area from breast to armpit for the symptoms we noted earlier. Repeat this on the other side to check your breasts. Easy, right? While a self-exam isn't a substitute for an exam by a doctor, 40% of all breast cancer cases are found with self-examination. Remember to partner your breast self-exam with regular visits to your doctor.